Bill and I started really thinking of some general ideas, kind of sketching it out in January. It actually started out, uh, interestingly enough, we sketched it on like a subway napkin. We wanted to incorporate some um, aspect of the lights, you know, being that that's the biggest thing that the program has added um, last year. Uh, we wanted to really focus on some individual aspects, uh, kind of bring forth the toughness of the game. Uh, at the same time, too, you know, uh, football is a sport where you know, the guys wear helmets and, and whatnot, so we wanted to kind of take that off and really show it for, you know, for the guys that were playing it um, and members on the team, uh, you know, kind of have it stand out while it's still being that, uh, that realm and that atmosphere of being a team game. Where it really started was uh, the bottom, the schedule portion. We started building that, and then it, it, oh, I make a schedule of ten different teams. Uh, you know, appear to be yeah, a ticket that would get you admission to the game. And I think from there, you know, we started thinking about the layout and of, of what a ticket looks like. And we looked at a few different things. You know, we asked the ticket office here at Dartmouth to, you know, give us what they had uh, as kind of a general idea of what goes on to a ticket. The rest of it was kind of. Uh, just building out from there, working on, um, you know, laying out what we wanted the background to look like, what we wanted the bottom, what we needed on there in terms of information for our Facebook, our Twitter, uh, our ticket information, and then in the background having um, the, you know, the, the picture that we wanted from last year's game. Each individual ticket is roughly 12 different layers. So when you look at um, the entire schedule as a whole. Um, it, there's about 120 working parts, if not more, to it. Um, so, you know, one minor change really throws off the rest of them. Um, in between, you know, game time changes and whatnot, it's been, uh, it was an interesting, that probably took the, the longest time, even though it's, you know, roughly about 33% you know, of the poster itself. That probably took uh, in the neighborhood of five to six hours working on that late. Shot in Leveron and we had a couple of lights set up uh, so that they would be able to be distinguished. It was uh, facing left, facing right, facing straight on in uh, several different poses, hands on hips, hands crossed, uh, footballs, helmets, um, you know, however intimidating they wanted to look and whatnot. So it was, uh, it was interesting to see them kind of, you know, want to come out of their shell a little bit and us telling them, you know the look of this poster is you know intimidating. It's uh, it's really getting down to the you know the heart of the game and, and the speed and and whatnot. So we we want to have kind of a, a more serious look. So some of them it was a little bit harder for them to be um, you know in front of a camera and not smiling um, or having a good time. But uh, you know every one of them was really great, uh, really receptive to what we were doing, and I think they'll be uh, pretty pleased with the the final turnout here. Good to be, you know, back in the back. uniform and everything like that. You know, representing the team, the new season coming up. Obviously, we're going for a Ivy League championship, and it just feels good to just be selected to do this whole posing shot for the poster. Yeah, and uh, I don't know, just be chosen to be one of those leaders. By the time we got the photos back from the photographer, we had them uh, cut out and, and laid out in, in, in the area that we wanted them. Uh, I think within two or three hours. So uh, we've been, uh, you know, really ready and raring to go on that. So it was a it was a long process. Uh, you know, you look at the finished product and uh, it's nice, but there's a lot of work that goes into it and a lot of uh, give and take and back and forth. A lot of people have their input on what they want, different places. Uh, but when it comes down to it, it's uh, you know we're really happy with how it turned out. It's a wrap.